All right, hey everyone. So recently, the battery light has turned on on the 2001 Toyota Sienna XLE, and had the AAA come out. They ran, they tested the battery, they tested uh, the alternator. Uh, one thing that I did notice as I started to take this thing apart was. As you can see here, my whole clip that tur that connects to this right here that is one of the cables is completely corroded and it just broke off. You can see this is it right here. So what I'm going to do is I did purchase a new alternator. I have not put it in. But what I'm going to do now is I am going to uh, remove the alternator and take it and have it checked out. Uh, perhaps it's the cable that just uh, burned up as how it looks right here. You can see the whole connector has come off completely. I just removed it and it came off completely. So I'm hoping that's my problem and hoping I can just put a new connector on and don't have to replace the alternator. But I will come back with an update and let you guys know. All right. All right. So just a quick finish up. I have my alternator replaced. Pretty simple. It was a removal of just a couple of bolts here. First one was, I don't know if you can see my, this one right here. It was a 12 millimeter uh, bolt. And then the other one that I did was this one right here and this was a 14 millimeter bolt and then this guy I had to wind up replacing because I did something wrong but this is also a 12 millimeter bolt right right there what this one will do is this one will loosen the tension on your belt here to get it to remove it off the pulley so I made the mistake and I did a I got everything set up, got it all pulled pulled in, got it all in, and I tightened up the bolts. I tightened up this 14 millimeter, and then also this side one right here. I tightened it, I tightened it up. And then I proceeded to tighten the belt so wrong so what I learned from here and I thought I would pass it along is you have to when you're putting these in just put in the other bolts don't tighten them down the two other bolts uh, put your belt back on and then come back and do the tension on your belt which is this bolt so I essentially had to replace it it was an M8 by 1.25 was the thread and now it was a 12 millimeter head. Now it's a 13 millimeter head. But I wound up buying it from a McMaster car. I went to the other bolt was roughly a little over 90 millimeters long. So I went ahead and bought a 100 millimeter long uh, bolt. And I got it tensioned. Got the belt tensioned. You can kind of see what's going on right there. And I got it, tensioned it up. Then I did tighten up the last two, the, the tightening bolts for the alternator. So far so good. I have turned it on and it is running correctly. I will have to find a, a boot that will fit over my reconditioned <laughs> connector here. Um, as you can see in the... Earlier in, in the earlier video, you can see this connector was just corroded completely. So when I went to yank it off the old alternator, it just completely fell apart. I did wind up cleaning off the connector, adding everything back in, making sure everything was good to go. And uh, now this is what I have. So it did start up. No problem. No squealing. No nothing else. So... Uh, once again, this is for a 2001 Toyota Sienna XLE 
pretty straightforward. It took me longer to receive the bolt that I ordered from McMaster Car just for the length. And um, hope this helps somebody else out there. All right, thanks.